And hello everyone, today we will continue our traditional summing up of the year. Today I decided to make a selection which I rarely have on the channel, but which are no less important. About the people who train our champions, about the trainers. And before we start, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video, because the more likes it gets, the happier my cat is. Yulia Bersukova is an Olympic champion in an individual program, and now the coach of gymnast of the Russian national team. In particular, Anastasia Guzinkova. In addition to this, Yulia Bersukova open her own rhythmic gymnastics schools, not only in Moscow, but also in other regions. In this top, Julia stands for the young star Nesta Vizinkova, who never ceases to amaze at world tournaments, increasingly appears in the company of already famous athletes, and who knows how she will turn around the next season. But this year she has already established herself as one of the leaders of the national team. Anna Vyacheslavna Dietchenka, a well-known coach of more than one world champion and Olympic champion. Of the most famous, Alina Makarenka, Daria Kantakova and the current star Alexandra Saldatova. In today's top, first of all, she's because she's always all next to the athlete. Her relationship with Sasha is a worthy example of how a real relationship between a coach and a gymnast should look. Along the training car Carpet, Sasha Saldatva together with Anna Vyacheslavna conducts master classes and a photo and autograph sessions. So what's especially sweet, Sasha communicates very well with her trainer's young daughter. And her daughter loves Sasha. So they have a really family behind the carpet. Irina Zinovka, choreographer of the Russian team. This year she was nominated for a National Sports Award as a Coach of the Year. So at least for that she is worthy of being in this top. Irina Borisovna makes exercises for gymnasts in the individual programs and groups. And also takes an active part in preparing athletes for important starts. Well, it is simply impossible not to include in this top coach whose pupils take all the medals of the competitions of the Russian and international level. Vera Nikolaevna Shatalina brings up two sisters, Arina and Dina Verina, for their achievements over the years and for wonderful interviews with reviews of girls. The head coach of the uh, national team of Ukraine, Irina Dirugina, for the special style in preparing the athletes of her country who stand out and remember, well, a special respect for the fact that Irina Dirugina finds the diamond that is sharp for years and is stable for each Olympics, who adequately represents the country at all international tournaments. Her last finding was Vlada Nikolchenka, and for sure she will surprise us in 2020. Ina Bustrova is a trainer about whom the gymnasts know a lot, but few know of these who are not involved into the gymnastics. Coach who has been involved in the YAF team of Russian group exercises for several years, and always leads te them to the victors. Well, no less interesting fact and achievement is that she already brought up a competitive Japanese team in group exercises, which Ina Bustrova has also been training for several years. Gymnasts from Japan are currently very competitive. With everyone, it's especially nice that such a wonderful coach helps them in this. Well, a little personal. When I was a gymnast, I was lucky to see how Ina Bustrova trains. So for me, this is also a very important person because I was struck by her kindness and right during one person. Irina Liparska is the head coach of the national rhythmic gymnastics team of Belarus. She raised a huge amount of gymnasts who achieved victories, including at the Olympic Games. She always represents herself as a smart woman and never climbs into the conflicts, for which I especially respect her. Well, in today's top, for young uh, talents, her gymnasts are Alina Garneskon and Anastasia Salas, who astonished with their production all season. I'm sure they still have everything ahead. But the fact that young girls are gaining momentum so quickly in the workshop program is a worthy place for this in our top coaches of the year. And finally, the coach I think about, which no one doubts why this woman is in, in this video. Irina Alexandrovna Vinerasmanovna. This year alone, Irina Alexandrovna completed the Palace of Rhythmic Gymnastics in Luzhniki, where the largest world competitions were held, including the first Junior World Championship. She always brings something new to the sport. She learns herself and teaches a vice woman and is always strict, tuned to the results of her pupils. All that the Russian national team in rhythmic gymnastics now has was not without her investments and strength. Many thanks and place of honor in our top for Irina Alexandrovna Osmanovna. Well, I expect from you in the comments to write down who do you think should stay in this top of the coaches of the year. I'm sure there are many more. Well, We'll see you in the next video. Remember that I love you all very much. And for now, bye.